so awesome. You know, not even just staying with his city, but the whole state of Wisconsin, just because oh, he yeah. is a great role model. Absolutely faithful, and how could you not like him, too? He's got that spunk, that ad. Did you see him walking around afterwards? He's like, yeah, just jamming <laughs> out. Fantastic. What a great game they had. And a beautiful morning as we are trying to wake up from a long night awake celebrating, right? Temperatures right now 52 degrees. It's crisp. It's cool. At least we don't have to deal with the heat and humidity today because yesterday, wow, was it a warm one. 86 into Wapaka and then 10 degrees cooler into Menominee, a high of 76 degrees. Here into Green Bay, we hit 82. We were actually cooler than Chicago, Detroit, nearing the 90s, Minneapolis hitting 90 degrees Bismarck again in the triple digits and in fact today we're actually cooling things down by 15 to 20 degrees or so as you see that cooler air spilling on in compared to yesterday morning Marquette at 45 degrees while down in Chicago 65 degrees we're right there in the middle look at this Pembine sitting into those mid 40s here into Green Bay into the low 50s and then down in towards Fond du Lac 63 degrees now the dew points into the upper 40s to mid 50s feeling crisp and comfortable winds out of the north light and variable at about five to eight miles per hour. Sunshine for a lot of us here in Door County in the Bay. We are looking at clouds pushing into the Fox Valley and also to the lake shore. We are looking at that rain into across the borderlands area and because of the cloud cover there we are seeing an air quality warning for that wildfire smoke into Minnesota where it is very unhealthy levels there as it is mixing down to the ground. Here for us though that air quality advisory has expired. We are looking at a moderate level once again here today but east coast starting to feel those effects as well but here for us whew, nice cool refreshing air moves in a high pressure temporarily builds in holds that low pressure away from us for today. So it's going to give us a mix of sunshine, some scattered sprinkles possible forming off of the lake as we have a lake breeze today, some comfortable dew points remaining all day long, feeling pretty decent before that heat and humidity really starts to crank up. Notice that starts to rise as we push into the weekend. Yeah, it's going to be a hot and humid one. But before that, we have this low pressure headed our way by tomorrow morning. That's going to bring us some showers and storms. Now we are going to see those arriving by about seven o'clock, a little break in the afternoon, and then a few more firing up into those evening hours especially as we push into overnight because another round heads our way. Now for tomorrow, we're not looking at any severe weather, just some stronger storms, some heavier downpours on occasion where we could see up to a half an inch if you're underneath one of those. Then this starts to advance towards us as we push into early Friday morning. That's going to give us some more storms and some heavier rain where we could see about a half an inch to three quarters of an inch from that system. But we need every drop we can get. We are still dry out there and Today, we're going to stay dry. Nothing to worry about whatsoever, except for the cooler temperatures. Highs into the low 70s by the lakeshore, mid 70s here for us. Then tonight, we fall down into the upper 50s as overnight lows as some more clouds start to build in. Then those chances for storms early tomorrow morning with temperatures only making it to those mid to upper 70s. This is all ahead of that heat wave. Check it out. We're going to rise quickly back into the upper 80s as soon as Friday and into Saturday, nearing 90 degrees. Again, with that humidity on the rise. It is going to be a hot and sticky one as we go through the weekend, but we dry things out with abundant sunshine. Good beach weather on Sunday. Perfect. So like you said, maybe turn the AC off today though, right? Oh yeah. Oh, you don't need it. Save Perfect. the money. <laughs>